Welcome back. It is time for Winey Wednesday here on Erie News Now, where we introduce you to different wineries all around the region. And today we have Chris Kane with 21 Bricks Winery with us today. Chris, thanks so much for joining us. A lot of events coming up for the month of September for 21 Bricks Winery. Uh, let's first talk about the wine club that begins at the first of the month. Yeah, so the wine club is um, something we do year round, but we do quarterly shipments mm -hmm. and we have one coming up this September 1st. It's something popular and, and if you're a uh, person that likes to receive packages or we like to give out gifts, um, we send out uh, a nice wine club with three wines, get nice recipe cards, and we, we make all the meals, try it all out, pair it up with the wine, and, and you're privy to special events if you're a wine club member. So our Easter egg hunt that we do annually that sells out in minutes, you're able to get early tickets to that, and then a bunch of the other events. We do a brunch in the summer as well for wine club members. And we also know you have the 11th annual birthday party coming up. What can people expect from that this year? Yeah, a fun time. Um, it's I can't believe it's in 11 years already. But um, we do uh, uh, we bring in food trucks. Uh, we have basil and bones. We do live music. We have two different bands coming and playing throughout the day. The event goes on September 10th from 12 to 7. We do giveaways. We have giant six liter bottles that um, we do yard games. So if we have a giant uh, I would call it pong type mm -hmm. game with a soccer ball and, and cups, and whoever wins that they they can win prizes and giveaways. So it's just a uh, and just a good time. Uh, usually the weather's, weather's cooperated for mm -hmm. us for the past several years. We hope it stays that way. But just us to celebrate uh, being there for 11 years and really we, we give so much out to say thanks for us uh, being, uh, you know, alive still and, being, and people coming to see us. And then less than a week after that, we have your farm to table event too. Uh, so once you finish up the birthday party, another event to uh, get excited for. Yeah, not, a, not like harvesting grapes is enough to do in the fall. <laughs> we decided to do all these fun events, mm. but the, the weather's beautiful in the fall if we can uh, harvest it, we do. Um, but we have a farm to table uh, event and we have a fall fest, but the farm to table, this is our second one we're doing. It, it unfortunately sold out already. They're exclusive events that we're starting to do. We work with uh, chefs from around the area. We create a, curate a menu, and, and we do it out in the vineyard or in the cherry orchard we did in the, in the spring. It's beautiful. The night works out, live music, and it's just a uh, specially decorated table. It's a real intimate setting, and it's, it's fun, and, and the meal is excellent. So is the wine, um, but it's a good time. And then let's talk about that Fall Fest event you have coming up on September 25th to round out the month of September. Uh, a lot of fun things with that, too. Again, uh, finishing out strong, we do a, this is our sixth annual Fall Fest. We work with a lot of local vendors. We bring them in and, and um, appreciating other small businesses in the area. They set up around our, our big patio and uh, people come in and it's just, uh, and then we have live music setting. And it's a good time. Um, but I know one little thing, I have, I have four little kids at home, they're now Elf's Best biggest fans, uh, Dylan, Gabby, Piper, and Finn. I said we'd give the shout out to you, but if you're out there watching, here they are. Absolutely. And also we know even though summertime might be coming to an end, still a lot of fun things to do in the fall time, yeah. uh, especially you know as we're going from the transitioning season still. Yeah, there, there's a lot to do, not only at 21 Bricks Winery, but mm -hmm. there's 23 wineries along the Lake Erie Trail from Harbor Creek to Silver Creek. And uh, it's a good time just to get out. Uh, smell the grapes in the air, the hustle and bustle of the mm -hmm. trucks and the farmers out harvesting their grapes. A lot of those miners, you can see the background of the picking and the pressing. And it's just a great time to be out and about in Long Lake Erie Trail. Absolutely. Well, thanks so much for joining us today, Chris. Remember, you have many options when it comes to shopping local, especially when it comes to your wine. And for more information on local wineries, you can check out Erie, Lake Erie Wine Country .org.